So today I'm going to do an install video for my front strut tower brace bar from ZZ Performance. This is from my 2004 Pony Grand Prix GTP. You can use these for any W body cars. This install will be a very, very easy install. It should take you about 15 to 20 minutes depending on you know, what you need to do. So here I have the Gen 2 ZZP front tower strut bar or strut brace. This is their Gen 2 version. The first version was just a solid bar. And these are adjustable. You can thread them in and out. Well you can pick up pick up these as easy performance for 80 bucks for any W body. Put a little sticker on here, maybe. I also bought some titanium nuts to replace the factory nuts. All you need is a 15 millimeter ratchet and 11 16 wrench fits this nut nice and snug. You shouldn't have to tighten these nuts up because these are already tight and they have the swivel bushing inside. I forget what they're called. All you really need is a 15 millimeter ratchet. Now you can take the nuts off by hand. But to make it easier, I'm going to use my electric impact. It'll be a lot faster. So all you're doing is taking the two bolts off closest in here. And then you take the bolts off, you take the water printer on. And then I'm replacing my nuts. I got these titanium. Titanium neo neochrome plated nuts for these, and they'll kind of dress up the engine bay. So it's a very easy install. Break them loose. Now, if you're replace if you're replacing these nuts, the factory strut strut bars threads is a M10 by 1.5 thread. So just keep that in mind. With all the salt we've had, kind of corroded. And then, just get your shut bar. Line it up without scratching it. If it doesn't fit, then just simply work on unthreading either end. Might have this on backwards. Thread that side. Yeah. <coughs> and 
what you have. Have it in the right position. Get it lined up. Another thing, the coolant bottle nut, it might be in the way. It looks like it should be fine. And then I'm putting these neochrome titanium nuts on. These are M10 by 1.5 thread if you're trying to find the nuts. Up, so you might have to wiggle it around to get it to sit down where it's supposed to be. I don't want to mess with these new nuts up, so I'm just going to use my ratchet to tighten it down. Now, before you do that, you can go through and adjust this bar. No, just twist it if it's turning on if you want to make equal distance on the other side make it stiffer I have a lot more stretch sticking out on this side Started tight and then tighten these down, and then you're done. Take your 11 16th wrench and just tighten these up. And that's all you that's all you need to put the ZZP front tower strut bar for the W body cars. Hope you enjoy this video. Stay tuned and I'll have more videos for you guys.